Okay, so on today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you install Super Smash Bros. Legacy XP. This is a mod for um, Super Smash Bros. for the Wii. Um, this is going to work for the Wii, the Wii U, and also on the uh, Dolphin emulator for the PC. Uh, but today we're only going to focus on the Wii and the Wii U. So you scroll down on this page. Um, you're going to have two releases of it. You're going to have the uh, full release. And also you're going to have the light release. So um, today I'm just going to focus on the light. Uh, the difference in size is about 4 gigabytes. So one is about 5.5 gigabytes. And the light is 1.5 gigabytes. So just go where it says Legacy XP Lite 2.1 for the Wii. So download that. Uh, now I'll show you what the files are going to look like. So here's the uh, all the files unzipped. Uh, so you have the apps folder uh, with both methods. Uh, this is going to work for um, the WAD channel and also for USB Loader GX. So this one's for the disk and this one's for the uh, USB Loader GX um, form. Uh, under the Legacy LT, you're going to have the WAD. Uh, one is for the Wii. So this is the one you install on the Wii. And this one's for the Wii U. So if you want to install it on the VWii, this is the WAD you'd have to use. Uh, so that's basically it to set up the SD card. Um, now we'll get over on the Wii. And I'll sh show you how to install the mod. Okay, now on your Wii, um, insert your Super Smash Bros. Brawl disc or plug in your USB uh, stick to the back of the Wii with the uh, Super Smash Bros. Brawl uh, game. Uh, first, we're going to install the channel because that's the way we're going to run it. Um, so go to the Homebrew channel, press A, start it up. Uh, now go to Wiimaw Lite, press A, load. Uh, go down to the WAD Manager, press A. Uh, go down to Legacy LT. Go to the WADs folder, press A. Uh, we're installing it on the Wii, so go to E, press A. And there it is, Legacy XP Lite 2.1, WAD, so press A, and press A to install. Shouldn't take too long. Uh, press A key to continue, press B, and then press Home. Should take you back to the uh, Homebrew channel. Now press Home again. Exit the system menu. Now you should have the uh, channel for the mod. There it is. Super Smash Bros. Legacy XP Lite. Now press A to load it. A to start. Now just go to play. It's going to take a few seconds. Uh, it's going to load all the uh, files from the mod. Press A. Um, create a save file. I'm just going to skip it. Continue without saving. I'll just skip the intro. Uh, go to Versus. Fight. 
there you go this mod has about 60 uh, different characters so just go through it pick whoever you want it's got mario dr mario luigi princess peach bowser yoshi wario donkey kong diddy kong Semis, um fox kirby links pokemon pikachu a whole bunch of pokemon characters and um sonics um rob the robot and so on so uh just pick your character i'm just gonna pick link so press uh two and now for the computer um just go to none so it picks it at random none none press start um Now you can pick your stage. There's about two pages on the light. I think for the full version, I think there's going to be more. So it's up to you which one you want to download. Um, so we're just going to pick one quickly, just random. So press 2 to load it. There you go, it starts up. So there you go, a pretty cool mod. Um, so just go, go through it, play around with it. You can play up to four players. Uh, you can also play online. Um, so there you go. Um, I'm gonna end the video here. Um, I'm going to leave the link in the description for the mod. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, on to the next one.